On the day that he was inaugurated, the Washington Post had an article on impeaching him. I, Donald John Trump, do solemnly swear. Donald J. Trump is now president of the United States. They had an absolute legitimate meltdown. If you try to change a system that big, the system fights back. The story behind the biggest election takeover in history. We're only now being able to finally confirm exactly how this worked. Mark Zuckerberg and his wife are donating more money to local governments ahead of the election. A hundred million dollars on top of a three hundred million dollar gift. The most money any individual has ever spent to win a presidential campaign in the history of our country. I actually became infuriated that someone had allowed Zuckerberg to tip the scale. The election was bought way before Election Day. They stole it fair and square. They changed the voting rules in the middle of the game. A nation divided. This was the greatest billionaire assault on election integrity we've ever seen. A billionaire-funded plot against the president. Do you believe that they used the COVID emergency as an excuse to pull this partisan voter turnout operation? Am I allowed to give you a one-word answer? Yes. It was really a partial takeover of the election system. I don't think we have to blame China or voting machines. I think we can look straight in the eye of Mark Zuckerberg, and that's why Joe Biden won. That's what this was. A corrupt, democratic voter turnout operation. You had them putting their own personnel in to actually run the election in places. You had an entire Democratic Party petrified that Joe Biden was going to be outspent, outboxed by Trump. Rigged. It was a rigged election. People have to find out what happened. 